There are 13 games in the National Hockey League today, and my betting systems recommend betting 6 teams. I'm Professor MJ, and I teach statistics to university students in Quebec City, Canada. Subscribe to this YouTube channel for the best sports betting information. Let's start reviewing each NHL system play right now. Here's my daddy, Professor MJ. <laughs> the first team that is backed by my hockey betting strategies is the New York Rangers at plus 144 odds playing in Boston. The system behind this pick is called the Blowout and it recommends betting a road underdog if they won their previous game by a margin of at least 3 goals. By following those rules, you would have earned a gain of 60.49 units via 818 bets, from risking just one unit per wager over 8 full seasons. That being said, the Rangers are indeed road dogs today, and they won their last contest by a 4-1 score. Up next, the second system pick goes to the Flyers at plus 133 odds, hosting the Hurricanes. This time we are making use of the Cold Teams Matchup betting system, which has been one of the most lucrative over the years. The third NHL pick is the Buffalo Sabres at plus 103 odds at home against Montreal. They are actually supported by two betting strategies at a time, including the cold teams matchup, which I just talked about. I don't like the fourth pick because it is backed by the two worst performing betting angles I've got. The play is the Vancouver Canucks, playing on the road in Columbus. I do not trust the fifth pick either, which is Winnipeg as slight road underdogs in Minnesota. The system behind the pick is the scoring drought, which is one of the two that I lost faith in. Finally, the sixth NHL system play goes to the Dallas Stars at plus 111 odds hosting the Colorado Avalanche. The hot scorers betting system supports Dallas since it suggests fading the visiting team if it has scored a minimum of four goals in each of their past three matchups. Colorado has been on fire lately with seven, seven and five goals scored in their latest three games. Historical data suggest betting against such teams. <laughs> A quick reminder that I am still not betting any NHL games yet since my systems don't do well in the first several weeks of the season. When they start performing better, as they have done in each of the past two seasons, I will come back making official picks and bets. Right now, the only bets I am making in the NHL are proposition bets. For example, I am strongly considering betting Patrick Kane over 3.5 shots on goal at minus 120 odds or 1.83 in decimal. So far this season, he has exceeded 3.5 shots on 11 occasions versus just 4 times where he failed to do so. Those are the types of bets that I share with my members on Patreon. By the way, we stayed red hot yesterday by going a perfect 4-0. We had the Bills minus 5.5 at the Saints, Michael Gallup over 60.5 receiving yards, Marquez Callaway under 38 and a half receiving yards and in college basketball we took South Alabama plus two and a half points in San Diego. If you wish to join the other 150 members 
for just $4.25 per day, simply follow the link below in the video's description. I'm Professor MJ. Have a great weekend, buddy.